Horses are on the track for the eighth race. Win, place, show, and exact a wagering on the Illinois State Fair Colt Stakes for trotting horses and geldings age four and older for a purse of $10,000. Right now, let's meet the starters, beginning with a two-time Illinois State Fair champion, million-dollar buy, owned by John Leahy of Westchester, by Anderson Racing Incorporated of Crete, Illinois, and by Tom Lewandowski of Indiana, trained by Joe Anderson. His son, Ryan Anderson, is in the bike. Two is A.J. Sammy, owned by Lilly Racing Stable, Incorporated of Downers Grove, Illinois, and by Ronald Gregerson of Missouri, trained by Jerry Hansen, the driver, Tony Morgan. Number three, projected profit is scratched. Number four, respect my authority, owned by William Lappy of Kelowna, trained by Katrina Rucker with Andy Miller in the bike. Number five is Star Diamond, leased, trained, and driven by Kathy Rutherford of LaGrange Park. And number six, Never Bet One, owned by Janet Vasconi and Claude Lawrence Sr. of Laura, Illinois, trained by Mike Berger. Dean McGee is in the bike. Post time in seven minutes. Behind the gate here, kind of throwing his head. Took a couple of awkward steps, but Ryan Anderson has him settled down and ready to go. Here they go for the State Fair Aged Horse Championship trot. They're off and trotting, never bet one. Flushes out from the outside quickly for the early lead. A.J. Sammy gets away second. Million dollar buy. Moves out third toward the inside as they go down to the first turn. In fact, everyone's going to drop in and go single file. No one willing to go with never bet one to the top. So driver Dean McGee says that's fine. We'll take the lead and they have it by a length. A.J. Sammy is in good position second. And there goes million dollar buy. Anderson sends him toward the outside. Up into the second spot now past the quarter mile mark in 29 seconds flat. Further back, Respect My Authority goes fourth, just three lengths off the lead, and a gap of four more to Star Diamond, who is last. Moving on to the back stretch, Million Dollar Buy takes over. He leads it by a length, headed toward the half-mile mark. Then Never Bet One in second. A.J. Sammy is third. Respect My Authority trotting in fourth, and Star Diamond is fifth and last, seven lengths off the lead. Back up front, there goes Never Bet One, determined to regain the lead off a half in 58 and one. Never bet one, leads it by almost a full length once again. Million dollar buy a second. A.J. Sammy is third, headed to the far turn, and then respects my authority, who has yet to make his move, and Star Diamond is still last. Approaching the three-quarter mile mark, it is never bet one who is on the lead. Now, million dollar buy takes to his outside, and A.J. Sammy is moving into contention third. Morgan has him poised and ready to strike. Respect my authority is right behind him. Three quarters in 127 and four. Never bet one leads it. Million dollar buy between horses. Here comes A.J. Sammy angling three wide at the eighth pole. Into the stretch, never bet one leads it. Here's A.J. Sammy down the center of the racetrack. A.J. Sammy gobbling up ground with giant strides. A.J. Sammy goes on by for the victory. A.J. Sammy wins it by two and a half. Never bet one second, million dollar buy was third in 155 and four. Into the winner's circle, the winner of the eighth race, the Illinois State Fair Colt Stakes for older horse and gelding trotters. Number two, A.J. Sammy, Tony Morgan with his third winner of the day. Sam Lilly of Lilly Racing Stable Incorporated of Downers Grove, Illinois in the winner's circle. Ron Gregerson of St. Louis, Missouri is the co-owner. He and his brother operate the St. Louis Cab Company, by the way. Jerry Hansen, the winning trainer. Jack Kelly making the presentation of the trophy. Executive director of the Illinois Harness Horsemen's Association. Incidentally, Sam Lilly, a director of that group, and Tony Morgan, the president. Sam, someone said that the IHHA could have had a staff meeting just now. How about it? <laughs> Well, you had half of the executive committee standing there anyway. Well, let's talk about winning at the Illinois State Fair. I know that uh, you grew up in Sullivan, Illinois. Got to be kind of a special moment anytime you've got a state fair champion. It really is, and especially for this horse. As a two-year-old and a three-year-old, both times we brought him to the state fair, he had a problem. He had a lump in his throat that we had to take care of, so I felt like he had to have an opportunity to win here at, at State Fair. Any horse of that caliber deserves that chance, and luck can be a part of this as far as keeping your health and everything this horse had bad luck in the past but your trainer jerry hansen has stuck with it 
congratulations on the win. Thanks a lot. Appreciate it. That's co-owner Sam Lilly of Downers Grove, Illinois. He's a champion at the Illinois State Fair. The rundown is next. <laughs>